Osmond reacts to Joe Rogan. What is this, me? Five. I'm not two. happy. Passive and porn star. Very the mountain. Popular. Yeah. She's and working so, her way up. She's working her way up. Streams. Isn't that crazy? Like I hardly heard anything. Like bro, that like Canute and, and like I mean you better you remember like Canute. It's like we all think oh it's Canute. You know, funny Norway guy. Aha. Yeah, bro. Canute won the Arnold Championship. True. Like that's like the the number two or number three. Okay. He uh he doesn't know that I was in the amateur division. The most prestigious bodybuilding competition in the entire fucking world. That's nuts, man. Uh, uh, yeah, it, it's it's crazy. So like, I mean, that's a big deal. Mr. Universe, I thought he did. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he did. Yeah, he did it. Yeah, I, I I'm pretty sure I fucking well, saw I the picture. I won, but it was the amateur. Sorry. They make it look the same, but it isn't. But it is, it is still. Let him live in the ignorance, Knut. It's bliss. It was pretty. The, uh, that is a big competition. It still is. Everything else he said about Arnold Classic is correct. Just so that is said. I will, I will give you the level. And th this is just to show you guys the difference. This is the scale. Norwegian Championship, that's the starting level. Norwegian Championship, that is down here. That is ground zero dog shit. Worst fucking thing you can do. Then you have, let's say, pro level. Mr. O. That is up here. Mr. O. This is Mr. Olympia. Highest level you can get. Arnold Classic, which is right below Mr. O. There. This is the pro. Pro division. And now, the thing is, a lot of the guys that was competing in Arnold Classic Amateur where I was competing, they could have also competed in Arnold Classic Pro. They wouldn't have won the show, but they would have been not last either. So I would say, down there, Arnold Classic Amateur. Then you have a lot of dog shit amateur shows in between. You have the Nordic Championship, maybe down here, somewhere in between here. Depends on who's competing. But you're like, you're a little bit behind. Still a win, true. The thing is, it's a bit mixed. Because some of the guys competing in Arnold Classic Pro Show would not have won this show that I won. There's no way the Norwegian Championship is worse than the Canadian Championship. I'll tell you, yes. If the, this is the Norwegian Championship, probably have the Canadian Championship somewhere here. Canadian Championship, it's probably up here. Depends on who's competing there as well. Should we watch this? DJ Mighty Mouse exposes Twitch. Had to leave and start streaming on YouTube, okay? I'm, I'm six hours past time where I'm supposed to be off here. Then I go, I, go, I go out the living room and she's sitting there, she goes, Okay, you gotta make a choice. It's either me or World of Warcraft. I was like... Bye, wow. I'm out. Deuces. Wow. From that point, I took a huge step away from gaming. Like I was like, I have to, I have to put away because I could not prioritize what was more important. It right? is they're, they're, very, they're very, very they're very, very obsessive. Yeah. But then now with streaming, Twitch, I've been able to monetize it and meet amazing people that I would have never met uh, through gaming. Are you making money off of Twitch? Um, I just recently switched to YouTube because all the Twitch bullshit. So what's the Twitch bullshit? Well, just you know, me, me, Jane were talking about it. Uh, so I, I don't want to say Twitch bullshit. Can I be more positive? Yes. So with Twitch, I find it hard, and I struggle with that. I've been streaming on the platform for nine years, and I haven't seen any growth. And that could be from my part too of not, you know, grinding is hard. But at the point in time when I was grinding, I was making probably about like twenty five hundred bucks a month. And just playing video games, right? I was able to cover mortgage, but my life was, I would wake up, train, after my first training session, go next door, stream for two hours, go up next door, back to AMC, train for another two hours, drive home, shower, kiss my wife, eat dinner, go back downstairs and stream. I had no life, that's all I did was stream. Stream, 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 stream. Sounds uh, familiar. Stream, and I was able to monetize and make good money. And then I sat down and I was like, I'm not having fun anymore. This is not. It's a job. It's a job. Like I don't. I don't want that. I like it as a job. But you, you know, when a guy says this, I didn't like it anymore. 
there's always bad days, good days, right? But he was, if he was standing flipping burgers for $10 per hour at McDonald's in the US, I think he would have said, please let me stream again. Right, and so then you start seeing girls utilize the platform on a different way with the hot tub streams. I, I ain't hating on them. I'm happy they were able to capitalize. What I'm hot tub. You like it because you're actually worked in dog shit low paid jobs. Yes, I have. Okay. And then it is the hot tub streamers. I feel like that is the absolute dumbest argument on this planet. Hot tubs. It's like they're talking about it like they're making a lot of money. How many hot tub streamers? This is the, there, there's basically none. You have one with 1k viewers, about the same as I have right now. Then you have 900 around there. And then you have fucking otters. This. And if you're just on this page, you get down to on the front page, top one, two, three, four, five. No, f streamer number 15 in this category has 76 viewers. It, it isn't like this is making bank. Don't close it. <laughs> it isn't like there's so many streamers here just, oh, they're just monetizing and grabbing money. There is. There's five of them. So that is always the stupidest argument saying, yeah, all of these hot tub streamers, all of them. Yeah, those five. And one of them is just, is this. Mr. Bean, yet. Yeah, <laughs> I want to hear what he's saying. Upstream. Okay, let, let me let me give you. I, you don't spend much time on the internet, so let me go ahead. And, well, you do watch people get murdered, but let me let me tell yeah, you. Yeah, but that's not much time. <laughs> I know. It's like thirty seconds. Oh, I got his fucking head chopped off. I've huh? cut my time down substantially. Yeah. So pretty much, people would do. You hear all this. For later. Hello, there, hello. there it is. Hot tub streams. Oh no, pools, hot tubs, and beaches. So that what is that? Uh, a whole channel. That's a what, whole that channel. That girl's doing yoga in her underwear what do, you think, what do you think they doing what do you think they trying to sell right there pussy okay <laughs> so i didn't know that that existed it Jesus does exist Christ. how many girls That's 40 that star. girl's only got 44 <laughs> viewers he's is saying what is she trying to sell pussy and then he says i didn't know that existed oh that's just that might not even be her stream she's a 40. popular porn star very popular she's and working so her way up she's working she way up. streams in a bikini and this is are the, you allowed to be naked? Like, no, you cannot. That that, that qualifies. Uh, you break the conduct code. Click, click, click on this. What is, this, so is, is the top, this? is the top female streamer. Yeah, she fucking Her. kills it. Kills it. A, a couple million dollars a month? Yeah. yeah. Wow. But see, boom, right here. This Why is, is this? Yeah, but we, it, we, we have to mention she doesn't make a couple of million dollars a month on Twitch. Those couple of million dollars that he's talking about is from way way more adult content on other platforms ad that popped up. this ad that pops up but she doesn't dictate what this ad is she has no say so what this ad is right yeah but for a couple million a dollars a month i bet she doesn't give a fuck so th this was a new thing in the platform that that came to right so yeah, I know Twitch viewers is going over. yeah so for me after nine years on Twitch, I was like, okay, I want to try something new. I, I want so to try. So you stream in your underwear now? No, I'm streaming on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> you know, there are a couple people who told me to do hot tub streams. Like, dude, can you stream in the hot tub? I was like, you want to see my half naked body? Don't you see it enough when I'm fighting? Right. He goes, he goes, I just For content, what is this? The fuck is this? Uh, yikes, I want to see chat, that is more interesting. Okay, we can turn it off, the sound at least. Let's see what... 1666 viewers, and how many t comments in chat? There was... <laughs> this isn't... This is what we're calling view bots. 1,666 viewers, my ass. 
If she's not restreaming it to a different page, because look here, if we go through user list in chat, we have now 1047. Just to compare. Look at the list when you're scrolling. This is for 1000 viewers, the list looks like this. 1600 viewers, the list is this. So it's obviously not weird. It'd be great to see you in the hot tub, man. I'm like, ban and get him out of here now. <laughs> <laughs> Put your pants on, yeah, sir. Exactly. So I switched over to YouTube. Um, that's been fun. Been able to make content on there. That's been great. So this is a girl. Uh, I like how the, the reverse angle. Oh, yeah. uh, the mirror? Yeah. So yeah. The, it's like... Like, so she's, it's fun hearing Normis talk about to, when they see this category. They have a mirror? Yeah. yeah. Doesn't everyone? Oh, Jesus. And so... I get the uh, oh. attraction. So that's the thing that is going on. And then now they, have, now they have poker. They have a big thing. I, everyone was complaining about poker because people will gamble on, on Twitch. And people were like, don't give me your money and I'll gamble it, right? And people are like, there's some people like, oh, I, that shouldn't be allowed. There's some people who say it should be allowed. So all that, I was like, you know what? I think I'm gonna step away from Twitch. I'm gonna try YouTube. And so far, YouTube has been great. Um, I've had a YouTube channel for a long time, but I've been trying to not post any MMA content, right? Like, people I don't wanna have any mixed martial arts. So just just gonna because do I wanna be known for do something some else mixed martial arts. An account right. of so it's zero. I love YouTube just because my channel hours is not when I'm not live. I'm only monetizing. Do you know what I will do, yeah? There's a, I will read it again. There's a hot tub streamer that posts 9,000 viewers and she is not even on camera. She debates people into staying by saying she's gonna do squats or some shit when she when a countdown hits zero, but she stalls for literally hours. It's so cringe. I'm, I mean, who cares if people want to do, if people want to watch this? It's up to them. Like, I, I don't, I don't see the problem to be honest. This is the Twitch hot tub meta may not be as it uh, I don't popularity anymore. Back when the start, uh, there's something very particular about Taylor's stream. She's rarely ever actually on it. Typically not visible for over 90% of this time. Instead, she stands uh, to the side, just off camera, talking to viewers who simply stare at inflate, <laughs> inflatable hot tub for hours to end. At least, I don't see no problem. Smart, yeah. Like so, uh, what people are complaining? Oh, they're showing off too much. They're doing this today. At least she's not showing off shit. They're showing a hot tub. It's a part of what's wrong with the world. Young people don't meet people in real life anymore. Trying to get romance on the internet. I kind of agree with you. Yes, but still, I can't blame the ones being on the internet for doing it. Like the people doing it. Bizarre, like what the fuck are these dudes doing? Listen, one thing I have learned from content creation on the internet is different people enjoy different content. And I've sometimes I can watch a streamer and I can say, or, or whatever other content, YouTube, TV show, and I can see I don't enjoy this content, but I can understand why others enjoy it. And then there's some type of content that I can see, see a lot of people enjoy, but I don't get why the fuck they enjoy it. And sometimes that's it. That's just how it is. Different content for different people. That's the only way I can explain it. And it's okay, yes. It is okay. And when I'm live on Twitch. Oh, I see. So people can go to your channel and watch the old videos. Watch the old videos. Oh. And, and the algorithm on YouTube on is Twitch. so much better than Twitch. So if you're a small streamer on on Twitch, you're never gonna get discovered. It's very, 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 very hard. Because there's so many people on there's it. So many people, and there's no algorithm to to pick you up. I switched to YouTube, and people are like, "I didn't even know you had a YouTube channel. I didn't know you stream." I'm like, "I've been streaming for fucking nine years." How if he's doing that, and he is the UFC champion, he's probably really bad at getting his all ready. Because I I would guess I have never. I'm not following. UFC at all, but I would guess he has a huge following on other platforms. He has been really fucking bad at taking advantage of them. <laughs> he was champ- Was is, doesn't matter. He probably has a huge following. Let's say, what is his name? 
DJ Mighty Mouse. What is his Instagram? Demo. Okay, thank you. Let's look him up. When you have 1.1 million followers on Instagram. Okay, something here is really off. Okay, 66,000. I get it then. I, I was a bit... He gets horrible engagement on Instagram as well. You have 1.1 million followers and you post a picture and you get 5,800 likes. Or 1,800. 403 13,000 2,000 260 K 4,000 so he has horrible engagement okay 77,000 this should have like 77,000 likes should have been the norm on his on his uh, Instagram a normal picture normally with that kind of following should have been around this number how do you not know I didn't stream and so then I read the comments and I comment back on the comments in the, on the YouTube channel. And then somebody says, oh my God, thank God for the algorithm because I would never find your channel. And when mm. I see that, I'm like, ah. And then if I do a reaction video, people send me stuff and I'll react it to uh, fake martial arts. And I'll sit there and just laugh about it and give my honest opinion about it. And people love and eat it up. And then it's still getting views and I'm still be able to get ad revenue and the monetization I on see. it. So that's why I switch over to YouTube. But it's all, all for a passion. Like I don't... But you can still do that when you're streaming on Twitch, just like we have done during Camp Knut and other. We, we put it on YouTube afterwards, right? There's no... You can even just press in the Twitch panel or in the... the you can just export to YouTube and it will, if you just want like he was doing, just send the whole thing over to YouTube. You can do that from Twitch as well. Yeah, this guy, like he, he wasn't completely wrong. I'm not saying that, but he... It seems like he doesn't take advantage of his own following. Doing he, he could have done better. And we all know, even though YouTube might have better algorithms, the user-friendly, uh, how it looks, how Twitch is made, is just so much nicer. The combination of Twitch chat and the video, Twitch is just so much better.